located at 3857 Foothill Boulevard in Glendale, California, the Boogie Bowl was surrounded by La Crescenta, Montrose, and Verdugo City, including Sullen Tahaga. It had the Rad Ramp, 17 feet tall, 8 feet wide, no vert, and no flat bottom. This was the Widowmaker. If you could make it to the top, you were good. You wouldn't want to slide down the side or end up in the back, all tangled up in the steel frame. Here, Don Hamilton is showing us how it's done. As you can see, this skate park is quite possibly the first concrete park ever built in 1977 with a concrete spine. A Widowmaker, if you were married at the time. This skate park was diabolical. It even had a scum line and brought us rippers like David Z, who rode for Hobie, Madrid, Al Peralta, the Bones Brigade, and the Boogie Bolt team. David was known for busting out the highest backside airs, frontside airs, front and backside ollies. He was a transplant from Louisiana, living in Tahunga, California, with style for miles. The team of skateboarders at the Boogie Bowl Skate Park would land them in second place during the Aspo Park Competition event on July 25th, 1979. In 2001, we'd meet up with Paul Bushnell at his home when he would share with us a gold mine. Moving pictures of a skate park that had long been demolished. Lost memories. Only in your dream would you remember these runs. We have more footage. We have more pictures. We have more interviews. We have some stuff to share that we hope you will all enjoy and get a great kick out of going back into the past. The Boogie Bowl closed in 1981 with the Pro Shop long gone. And yes, Alfred, Alfred Newman, Newman is, is Don, Don Hamilton. Hamilton. Thank you.